What's going on, everybody? It's Davey from the 80s, and you are now entering the Cinema Chop Shop, so park your ass right there. And while you're there, don't forget to hit the like, the share, the subscribe button. Also, if you check the link below, you see a Patreon account. If you click it, you become a member. All you got to do is try recommend movies and music and trailers for me to react to, so click the damn link. Now, with that being said, we're here today with a little bit of Godzilla news. Now, uh, all over the internet, you know what I'm saying? These images have appeared and then disappeared, right? They've been uh, uploaded and then deleted. So I've got a hold of some of these pictures and I'm going to share them with you. So right now I'm going to show you just a quick little slideshow. It's only about three images of the leaked toys that are associated with the Godzilla Kong New Empire movie. Let's go. As you can see, Godzilla has a red aura. The red aura, most likely, he's gone nuclear. Uh, so <clears throat> if you've seen Godzilla, King of the Monsters, this is probably like a kind of callback to that. Um, I kind of forgot what they were calling it. Um, Crimson King Godzilla, right? So allegedly, that's what it was called. Crimson King Godzilla. <clears throat> and... We we kind of already seen this already. We seen him kind of go nuclear already, so it's not really much of a, it's not really a big thing. Now, what did catch my interest though is Kong. Kong was over here. He looks very um electrifying, if you will say. So a lot of people have been kind of hinting and rumoring that there is a possibility that Kong might be getting his um electrical powers back that he got, not back, but if you watch the original Godzilla versus Kong, then you would know that. Got, uh, Kong had electrical powers and there's been long rumored that Kong was going to eventually get these powers in order to kind of like compete with other villains so we will see if that's the case now um also uh we have been we finally introduced with Shimu which is the ice dragon the one of the antagonists in this movie uh the one if you guys watched my spoiler review, he is the one that's basically going to be an essential piece of this movie because he's going to be trying. He's going to be trying to basically send the world into another ice age. Um, and I, I think originally Godzilla defeated this monster. And this is kind of like, you know, round two fight type shit. Um, it was, it's interesting because we have not seen any leaks or designs or anything like that. We've only seen people kind of like conceptualize art. Uh, but we have not seen like an actual leak. I know these leaks are very fuzzy. I know they're very blurry. But at the same time, I think the person that was taking the picture wasn't supposed to take them. And <laughs> that's why we are uh, with these leaks that we have. Now, for those of you saying that there's a possibility that these could be fake, hey, it's possible. But at the same time, this was the same thing that happened when the Warbat leaks uh, came out last year. And everybody thought the Warbat was going to be the main antagonist. Uh, and he turned out to be just like a quick cameo. Uh, but we always end up, this always ends up happening. The toy leaks come out, people get a hold of the toy leaks, they put them out, and then that's when we have an idea of what these characters will look, look like. So, um, we do know that Godzilla and Kong are supposedly getting enhancements, more specifically, Kong. Kong is getting enhancements. I did see some video clips where they had like both Godzilla and Kong in like cybernetic outfits. I don't know the validity of that and honestly it kind of reminded me of the cybernetic enhancements that were giving to Godzilla and Kong uh during the Godzilla versus Kong run of toys like I don't know if you guys remember when Godzilla had that red thing on his back and then Kong had like enhancements too uh yeah there's like a run of toys that have that but that was never used for the movie so I'm going to kind of just chalk this up to those enhancements are more than likely not going to be real Right. But we did hear that Kong was going to have some human upgrades, which means that the humans in this movie were going to give him some upgrades. So we'll kind of see where that goes. But I'm kind of more sort of leaning and hoping that Kong gets them electrical powers. I feel like that'll be a little bit more beneficial if we get um, some of those leaks of uh, the monkey that's supposed to be uh, son of Kong. If you know what I mean, um, if we get some leaks for that, I definitely will upload those. But these are just the images I got. I know, like I said, I know they're very hard to see. 
Uh, but at the same time, hey, it is what we got. Um, this is our that was our first look at Shimu, which is the ice dragon. And we have yet to see the Scar King. Now, I do have an image of the Scar King and Shimu and Godzilla and Kong, but I question the validity of it, so I'm not gonna upload that because it possibly looks like it looks kind of like somebody just colored a damn dragon like they found a dragon online and colored it made it look like it because it doesn't to me it doesn't look exactly like the one in the image the the one in the image looks like it has like some mobility it looks like it can move around and the one I, i've seen it kind of seems like they have it, that one has limited mobility so i'm questioning the validity of that leak i'm not going to upload that one but i just wanted to let you guys know that i do have one that's really clear but i don't know if it's real or not so i'm not even going to post it so uh what do you guys think do you guys dig what you see what you can see of the design are you guys liking the idea that kong may possibly have an upgrade <laughs> do you like the idea of the return of burning godzilla aka the crimson king uh let me know in the comment section down below and you are now exiting this in the chop shop don't forget to subscribe homie hit the damn button you know what i'm saying anyway you are now exiting this in the chop shop hope you guys are mad at this today Adiós, amigos.